how are you sizing up a founding team when, when you're in a room with them? I'm going to uh, tell you an anecdote that uh, from when I talked to Jim Getz from Sequoia about why they invested in Metaswitch. Uh, and uh, I was sitting in Jim's office in, in Palo Alto and uh, asked him, because we were somewhat atypical, we were 25 years old when they invested in us, asked him what it was that attracted him to Metaswitch. And Jim said, well, there are only three things that we really care about at Sequoia. The first is the people. The second is we like to invest when the company is uh, relatively young and still has lots of opportunity for growth. Uh, and the third is that we need to be able to cycle from our offices on Sand Hill Road to the head office of the business. Let's take those in reverse order. So we clearly cannot cycle from Menlo Park to Enfield. It's about 6,000 miles. <laughs> um, so we've knocked that one on the head. Uh, the second criteria about being young with lots of opportunity for growth, well, your business is 25 years old, so you don't really meet that one either. So all I can say is you must have scored double marks on the first criteria, which is the people, which was a very long way around of saying, actually, it's the people, stupid. You know, that's all that we care about, ultimately. And I think that has been a, um, a guiding light for me in my investment decisions. Think very hard about the people. Um, what exceptional characteristics do they have that will allow them to be resilient, thoughtful, um, robust, and ambitious? Um, and it's a combination of those things um, that essentially you're relying on because the business, when you invest at the early, very early stage, which I do, uh, the business is almost certainly going to change before it actually reaches product market fit. And there's going to be a lot of bumps in the road, as we talked about earlier. And so you're always looking for people who have um, that um, self-belief, but tempered by um, humility, realism, um, and combined with creativity and the ability to, to bounce back time and time again.